Widgets typically have more properties than can be accessed by just editing the widget, instead using property nodes and some programming. In other cases, programming the widget is much more convenient than editing it. For example, I recently wanted to set the x-axis of an xy graph to have specific values. I wanted it to have a middle frequency flanked by values at the edges and no other values in between. Right clicking the widget, choosing X scale, setting marker spacing to arbitrary and then adding markers works, but it is tedious. Setting the values for an axis is more conveniently done through the property called marker values. It does not affect and is not affected by other things like auto scale or display range. In the block diagram, I right click on the indicator, choose create, property node, x scale and marker values. To this, I want to go to range and add the minimum and then the maximum. and then change them all to right. Let's say I have a middle frequency of 9 MHz and I want to show 5 kHz to either side of it. I add the middle frequency to the marker values array and that is the only value that is needed. I set the minimum and maximum values by subtracting and adding 5000 and setting the range accordingly. Then if I run the VI, the values show up on the X axis.